The Book of Psalms Psalm 58 To the chief musician Altasketh, Mictum of David Do ye indeed speak righteousness, O congregation? Do ye judge uprightly, O ye sons of men? Yea, in heart ye work wickedness. Ye weigh the violence of your hands in the earth. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. Their poison is like the poison of a serpent. They are like the deaf adder that stoppeth her ear, which will not hearken to the voice of charmers, charming never so wisely. Break their teeth, O God, in their mouth. Break out the great teeth of the young lions, O Lord. Let them melt away as waters which run continually. When he bendeth his bow to shoot his arrows, let them be as cut in pieces. As a snail which melteth, let every one of them pass away, like the untimely birth of a woman, that they may not see the sun. Before your pots can feel the thorns, he shall take them away as with a whirlwind, both living and in his wrath. The righteous shall rejoice when he seeth the vengeance. He shall wash his feet in the blood of the wicked, so that a man shall say, Verily, there is a reward for the righteous. Verily, he is a God that judgeth in the earth. find the hole you put your finger in. Then say, that was me. <laughs> you're a nothing. You'll not be missed a little while after you're gone. They have a funeral procession out here and that's all. But your influence yeah. will live on and on and on. That's why today in the midst of infidels, they've never been able to explain and get away from the influence of one man, Jesus Christ, who was God made flesh. When he stuck his life down here on earth, it made a suction of a place that draws all man unto him in the great whirlpool of his life that was once on earth. You can't get near it without being drawn into it. But you and I, we're nothing. We're nothing. You can never make yourself something that you're not. If you're just impersonating Christianity, no matter if you're preaching the gospel, you need an altar call in your soul. Right? If you're just trying to act like that person that's a Christian, you're miserable yourself knowing in your heart that you're not. And if the fruits of the Spirit don't follow you long, suffering, goodness, meekness, gentleness, patience, and you need an altar call in your heart. You just... Feared hell and started off trying to be a Christian. God has to call you to be a Christian. God called Abraham, give him, elected him.